Hey guys, make sure to stand to the end. If you make one common mistake, you may spend hundreds, even thousands of dollars on repairs, parts, diagnostics that you don't need. Make sure to stand to the end. We will explain what we're talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a Chevy Silverado, that generation here from year 2007 to year 2013. If you need to find guys where the fuse for the trailer left turn signal is located, which fuse you need to check, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays, the good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste your money and time. And why it's important to always guys test fuses and relays, all that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure to stay until the end. So before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us guys. If you have a Chevy Silverado, that generation, that's the second generation from year 2006 to year 2013, we'll be making a video about every single fuse relay. Why? Because if you're in the middle of nowhere, you're down the road, you need to find a fuse for fuel pump, ignition, immobilizer, parktronic, anything like that. All we have to do, watch that video, spend less than a minute or two, find it, fix your problem, you're back on the road. Because most people will lose their manuals or it will not be clearly specified in the manuals. Some fuses have multiple functions. So we'll be having more than probably 150 to 200 free repair videos on that. We guys make video constantly here at the garage. We take things apart, engines, transmissions, bodywork, a little bit of everything. And we have more than 12,000 free repair videos on our channel that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs please check it out in addition guys if you need to buy any parts tools special fuses anything like that at a really good price quick shipping that way you do not waste your money and time we'll share the links in the description of the video below so let's start on it now so the trailer left turn signal fuse where you can expect to find it we'll demonstrate on that generation Chevy Silverado right here now you guys have three different fuse boxes in that truck and today we're working just one that's located right under the hood. Pop the hood open facing the engine on the right side you have a fuse box under this cover right here. Go ahead and open that cover guys. Once you do that you're going to find a fuse box with a layout that will look just like this one here. Now before we guys continue let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. It is guys very important to test fuses and relays. On those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not, especially you can see in the JK's fuses as well. And if you guys assume, okay, you, let's say you remove a fuse, you look at it and you assume guys that it's a, actually a, a good fuse, but it's actually a bad fuse, sometimes you cannot clearly see that. What can easily happen guys at that point, uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to, so you lose your time, you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it. We'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses, how to check relays very easily as well guys. So uh, check it out, it will be in the description of the video below. So for the left turn signal which fuse we will need to check, it will be just one fuse guys that you will need to check. This here is towards the front of your Chevy Silverado, this is the windshield side, passenger side, driver side, here if we zoom in a little bit guys, okay you're going to notice that we have that row of fuses right here, and in that row of fuses guys, the first one that you see right here, this is known as fuse number 3, that's the one for the trailer left turn signal that you will need to check. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to let us know. Hopefully the video was helpful and see you guys next time.